Easiest to fabricate steel stair. Advanced steel tutorial with the template included. Go to my website. You will find a direct link below the video. Download the template to your hard drive. Click the link, the download will start. Save the file to your local hard drive. Go to the folder where the file is saved. Extract the file. Open Advanced Steel. Open the stair template file. You can delete this stair. We will create a new one. Go to the Objects tab and select the Floor tool. Specify the first point of the floor as 0, 0, 0. Specify the other point of the floor as 8 feet, 12 feet. Draw the vertical line to specify height between floors as 10 feet 4 inches. Type L for line, enter, and 10 feet 4. Use the copy tool to make the slab for the second floor. Use the lowest point of the line as a reference point. Open calculator. Convert 10 feet 4 distance into inches. Divide total height by allowable razor height of 7 inches. We need to create a total of 18 razors and 9 razors to landing. We need to create a total of 9 razors to the landing, which translates to 8 steps. Step width is 11 inches times 8 steps equal 88 inches. Draw a horizontal line 88 inches long. Change the color of the line for easy identification if you wish. Move the line representing the required distance from the floor to the landing to the other end of the 88 inches line. Draw two 1.5 inch long horizontal lines. One line is representing the stringer width, the other line end is a point where we're going to cut the stringers off. Type G and enter to group everything. Move the line group to the side. Draw vertical line 1 razor tall. Move the line to the stair start point. Group the lines. 
Draw the horizontal line representing the width of the landing. Move this line to the edge where the landing will be created. Copy layout line work to the other side. Rotate line work 180 degrees. Go to the Home tab and Extended Modeling to initiate Star Tool. Choose the type, start and end point, type 0. Click on the first and last razor points. Choose the right side too, to create a stair. Your stair is created. Now choose a template to apply settings. Go to library and choose a 3 feet 11 inches wide stair. Go to landings and deselect front and rear. Remove the last step in TH stair top section by entering zero values. Initiate the stair tool from the home tab and extended modeling panel. Repeat the entire procedure. Alternatively, you can copy and rotate the stair. Place UCS 1.5 inches away from the first razor. Rotate the UCS. The X, Y plane should be perpendicular to the stringer. Cut off the stringer at the UCS. Rotate the UCS to cut off the bottom of the stringers. Move UCS to the top of the stair. Cut off the top. Rotate the UCS and cut off again. Perform a similar procedure to the upper flight.
Notch the bottom. Use the contra cut command. Draw 48 inches line. Use rect to draw rectangular. Make sure your XY UCS plane is horizontal. Use the beam from line command. Select desired beam section. Adjust positioning. Draw supports using beam from line command. Use the beam from line command. Choose desired member section. Use the miter cut command. Apply coping to supports angles.
Copy coping. Lending is completed. Finish modifying stringers. Create a plate using the plate command. Copy and paste the plate. Adjust the position of the landing. Create landing top plate. Place UCS at the top of the landing. Choose the make a plate tool. Draw the plate between corners. You can adjust the lower floor size.
Make plates for the front. Place UCSX, Y plane perpendicular to the string. Copy the plate and apply to the remaining locations.